What is going on, everybody? It's Brian from Brian Loves Bonsai. I am back with another video. It was probably like a week or two weeks ago now that the Tropical Storm Ada came through, and I woke up in the morning and found this guy sitting on the floor. The pot was busted, and so it's time for a repot. And uh, so this is a Green Island ficus. I actually made this tree for the Reddit, the last Reddit contest that actually that we went through with, and uh, I really like this tree a lot. I think it's coming along. Uh, it's got a lot of long growth, and so I decided that I was going to style it before I got it in the pot, uh, just to get the orientation going pretty well. Even though I'm not really considering this pot as any type of final choice. This is pretty much just the only pot that I had sitting around that would be conducive to a cascade. Right now I did go searching for like a rock slab type formation at some local places but didn't find anything that I was interested in that would work really. Um, as you can see there's a ton of aerial roots coming off this thing. Um, nothing really special about how that happened. It's, it's in full sun and that area of the tree is kind of just hanging off the hanging off the bench so they're just growing reaching for the ground um, it would be very cool if I had some sort of sloping rock face which I would love to get this thing onto in the future but for now I just need to get it in a pot so as you can see I'm just using some of uh, some structural wiring to get these big thicker branches oriented in the right direction um, they are very flexible, but at the same time, they are they they got pretty thick over the course of the year, so I definitely had to use a little bit of a thicker wire to get these in place. Um, it was actually kind of a good thing that this pot broke when it fell, because the shape of the pot was one of those where the opening was smaller than than the widest point. So the widest point of the pot was actually in the middle and you'll be able to see that kind of when I take the the tree out of the pot to start working on the roots uh, but anyways I'm just going to go through and just kinda of get this styling oriented I'll put some music on and then when I get to the repot I will jump back in here I hope you enjoy I'm back guys and you can see what I was talking about in regard to the root ball it's uh definitely fatter in the middle so it's kind of a a blessing in a sense that the pot broke and I was probably gonna have to do something weird to get it out of there anyway um, this soil fell apart really easily it grew some nice roots uh, but that definitely was a really tight fit I remember trying to get it into like as tight a fit as possible at the time most of the soil is in the center 
is just like a traditional potting soil that black you know really absorbent soil and the edges is where I was able to get the bonsai soil into the pot and you know that's where a lot of the new growth took place and will take place every time um, <clears throat> so I'm just gonna kinda clean these out a little bit nothing special this pot is a lot bigger than the pot that it is in so it would fit straight in but I'm just kinda cleaning things up I probably won't do too much pruning but just kinda cleaning up some of that old soil trying to brush out a little bit of it and you know each time replacing more and more bonsai soil until it is grooving with just bonsai soil um, again I'm just going to pretty much go through the process I'm just gonna get the orientation correct nothing special so I'm gonna put on some music and let you watch me finish up if you have any questions please feel free to comment I hope you enjoy the rest of the video and the end you can see the finalized 360 have a wonderful rest of your day Thank you.